Welcome to the fourth in a series of tutorials designed to enable you to use the Queensland Globe with confidence. In this tutorial we will explore how to save and share our maps with others. For sharing maps, two approaches will be looked at. One is a method of saving and sharing our Queensland Globe map. The other is printing our map view. The learning outcomes from this tutorial are saving your display settings and data as a map, sharing your maps and data with others, how to print a map. Before we can save and share our maps, it is necessary to log in. Click on the Login or Sign Up button. The Login account options will display. Choose the option that you are comfortable with. You will know you are successful when you see your name displayed. Click on your name and you will be presented with further options where you can update your details, choose to delete your account or sign out. Once logged in, we now have the option to save your current Queensland Globe session as a map. This will ensure that the data layers, map extent and any custom map objects you've created in places will be saved and available in future sessions. Within Maps, you will see an option to save as. Give your new map a name, and here you can also choose to include any customised map objects you have created and stored in places. If you have multiple saved maps, switch between these by clicking the icon beside the map name. If the map is altered in any way, this icon will change colour and indicate it is now being edited. You will then have the option to save the edits or save the map as a brand new map. Choosing Exit Map will give you the option to discard any changes since your last save. There are multiple options to share your saved maps and custom map objects with others. As we click on the down arrow of your map, you will see an option to share. You can customize the map name here, and there is also a tick box option to include custom map objects you have stored in places. Other things like the extent of your map window will be retained when you share your map. Clicking Next will display the web address or URL of your saved map. You can copy this URL or choose one of the other common platforms to share your maps and data. You should note that the URL for your shared map is only active for a short time and will expire after 30 days. If required, people who receive your shared map can save it under their own Queensland Globe profile. This will ensure that the map and data do not expire. Another way to share your map and your custom map objects is through print. When you choose to print, a new tab will open with numerous options like page orientation, page size, viewing mode and map scale. You can also toggle the coordinate system. Use these options to customise your print preview. These print templates have been designed to adhere to our mapping guidelines. You can name your map and also include a subtitle to provide more detail. If you need to refine the map, you can enable the zoom controls by clicking the lock and alter the map as required. Once satisfied, click again to lock the map extent. A legend is used to display the data layers in your map. You can choose if you want to display the legend. Depending on how many data layers you have referenced, the legend may appear as additional data on a second page. When you are ready, choose Print and select which output you would prefer. 
printing to PDF will allow you to print or easily email your map. Alternatively, printing to a PNG format will allow you to insert your map as a picture. To return to your globe map, close the Queensland Globe print browser window. We hope you have enjoyed this tutorial on the Queensland Globe. If you need further assistance, please have a look at the other tutorials in this series. Check the in-depth guide on our help page or email open data.